Alright, we're gonna showcase our reduping and test something, uh, cause I'm vaguely interested in people on a visual. So, I'm gonna show kinda how this works. Alright, um, so first we're going to get the thing that we want to do. We, we just need to load it into the game's RAM at some point. So we're gonna just go here, and then this is the closest thing I have to where the, um, the Podor is. I'm just gonna beat this Po real quick. Probably should have done a video on something that I know would work, but whatever. If I get credits for with this, then uh, I'm not posting this video until like the speedrun happens. That would actually make this useful at that point. If you got like overall if you and um, did credits warp. I don't know where that would put you. I mean, I assume it would put you in Arbor's Bounds, but yeah, I can't know. Anyways, this should technically work with any item that gives you text. So if you get Uku, for example, it's gonna give you text saying, you got Uku. Um, but yeah. So, what we're gonna do is we're going to go back through here. We're gonna go backwards through a few rooms. Uh, we don't need to grab that. Ooh! What if you could do boss keys? That'd be cool. I, I don't know what- I mean, you could probably do it. I don't know what overall boss key would do, though. You could probably do small keys, too, for that matter. We're gonna have to test some stuff. That's all I'm saying. What's probably gonna happen is it's probably gonna crash my game. And then I'm gonna have to record something that I know will work. Okay, so I should be able to go back through this other room right here. Assuming it's not a key room. Yeah. Yeah, there he is. Okay, nice. Alright, so we want to do Q, right? We got Uku. Okay, so we got Uku. Alright. And that's the last item we've gotten in our inventory. And hopefully I don't screw this up, because I get one shot at this. Because if I mess this up, I'll get Oru's memo. That would be bad. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go talk to the Goron. And then I'm gonna get enough um, bits. I think I only need one, but we're gonna get all of them anyways. Uh, I just need enough so that Aru is gonna be almost done talking. And some of these steps might be unnecessary. This is just all I know for now. We're just gonna go up here real quick. And get hit by every single meteor on the way up. Doesn't really matter. As long as we don't grab any items that give us text, it shouldn't matter. two minutes out <laughs> of something. And I actually have no idea what the game is going to give me.
Dude, what if you had an overruled Uku and then you could just go back wherever the heck you wanted? Whatever. Anyways, I just need to talk to the Goron guy like four times. I probably don't even need to talk to him four times, but I'm not about to test it. Yada yada yada. Yada yada yada. So the important thing is that we get to the end of the text and we don't get Aru's memo in the process because that would make it so that when we did the cutscene here we would get Aru's memo. So it'd be the last thing loaded into RAM. Um, and so... Oh, I think I might get why this didn't work before. Anyways, I don't know, I don't know how many times you can get this to work over and over again. I know it's at least two. But anyways, um, so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk to Aru once, which is going to make absolute certain that he's all the way through his text. Um, because it's going to exhaust some of the current bits to basically make sure he's past where he would have given me the memo, but the ground trigger is still active. And so essentially what that's going to make him do is it's going to make it so that the cutscene script plays out in a weird way, because it's supposed to already be done, and because of that... It doesn't actually decide what item it's supposed to give me, so it just gives me that's the last thing in the RAM. I believe that's how that works. Okay, so yeah, I just need to talk to him once, and then we'll see what the heck this will give me. But see how he's basically listing his uh, post-cutscene text over and over and over again? He also doesn't ask me yes or no on this. Oh my god, I got an Uku. Where does this take me? I want to know at this point. I wonder if this depends on where you use it. This is amazing. This is giving me fire's text. But where is this going to warp me? That's what I want to know. I, uh, well, it's warping me somewhere. Where am I going to go? Is this just a soft lock? It's just a soft lock. Wow, that's awesome. <laughs> I can't do anything. That's amazing. Okay, well anyways, that's uh, our review. Thank you.